Now, we're still waiting on results from Marquette County. Local 3's Rebecca Bartlemy joins us live now from Gwynn Area Community Schools with more information about what they were asking from voters today. Rebecca, you spoke with the superintendent yesterday. Yes, James, we are still waiting on those results, but I did speak to Superintendent Sandy Petrovich, and she says that this is the third time they brought this issue to the voters. Now, this would go towards things like replacing flooring, tiling, some, repair, some repairs on the plumbing system in the schools, and some work needed on the science labs. She did also tell me that this is, they've made some revisions to this from the past two times that they brought this to the voters, and that it at one point was 1.75 mils, and they brought that down to 1.5 mills and it was originally a 10-year millage that they brought out to a four-year millage. Now according to the school's website, the top three things that this would go towards in the first year would be uh, E911 system that would be district-wide, repairs to the plumbing system in the elementary school, and uh, ele the elementary school cafeteria tables. And now, like we said, that there are no results yet for this, um, but you can check out our website, upmatters.com, where we'll, we will have those results for you um, on the top of our, our home page. There's a banner there where you can find that. And it also, if you scroll down, there's also some elec election results there. But for now, I'll toss it back to you in the studio. Reporting live in Gwynn, Rebecca Bartlemay, Local 3 News. James, back to you.